Hey guys, this is Coach KP and today I'm going to show you a technique that will help you ward off and keep at a distance any kind of physical or astral impurities. Okay, so this goes for any kind of virus, bacterial infection, any kind of energetic situation that does not resonate with you when you walk into a room with, you know, room full of people that you're not resonating with you can use this if you're a nurse a hospital staff you can use this technique before you walk into that nursing ward to try to protect yourself energetically okay so before i start and give you a demo of this technique there's a couple of things that um, i want us to pay attention to today so the the vibration the sound that we're going to make today is of m the third syllable of om so om is a three syllable word a o m we are going to use the third syllable m the m vibration for this so let's just from the center of our heart make that vibration m So that sound, that vibration is going to be a part of what I do here. And when we do this technique, we try to bring that sound into our chest and make that chest vibrate throughout that entire sequence, both the times, okay? So the first time we do the sequence, it's going to be for our physical body. And the second time we do the sequence is going to be for our astral body. Now, one more thing I wanna say is the mudra that we are going to use in this technique, okay? The mudra we're going to use in this technique is called the Guru Shishya Mudra. And here is what we're doing. So Guru Shishya Mudra, okay? So Guru as in the teacher and Shishya as in the person that's receiving the knowledge, all right? So here is what, here is how you should clasp your hands, all right? So the, the pointed side um, with your index finger, that side, we point it out to the physical sun. And the thumbs, you point to yourself, okay? So in the beginning of this exercise, what we do is, let me back off here so my whole body is seen. And this, this is best done early in the morning as the sun comes out, but you can do it anytime throughout the day or even at the absence of the sun because what we are really referring to when I say the sun is the spiritual sun, okay? And so I'm gonna to turn towards the sun and I'm gonna close my eyes and use the Guru Shishya Mudra to appeal to the sun for a connection. Now, once you feel the connection established, what you will do is you bring the mudra right on top of your crown chakra. Do. Now, after this, what we do is we mentally ask for the spiritual sun to fill us with the divine light. Once this is done, we start chanting the Makara. Mm. So what we will do as we chant the Makara is we use the palm of our hand with the intention of using the solar balsam, the solar rays to nourish us and to create a protective barrier. And after you reach your foot, what we are going to do is extend the hand out onto the earth and then pull back the energy from the earth. And then we bring it onto our bodies 
and in the in the dantian the abdomen area we rub nine times <sighs> let go of negativity And then grab the energy, the back, after you flick it from the top of your head, and then bring it back down. So that was the first round. Now I'm going to do that entire round again, and I will do it in one motion, all the while chanting the Makara. Okay? So here I go. So that was the first round. That was to protect our physical body. Now we do a second round. It's the same motion, but we will use our astral body this time. So what we do is we extend our hand on top of our crown chakra, extend it as much as possible, chant the makara as we do the technique. So we do this two times, one for our physical body and one for our astral body. In hope that was clear, uh, my demonstration was clear to you guys. I've been doing this every day for the last year or so and I've had some incredible accidents that I could have been seriously injured, especially at the gym a few times. And I literally felt one time that the weight had fallen from on top of my head and it was sure to hit me but that weight got deflected somehow I don't know I don't know how the weight was deflected and it saved my life so many times similar things have happened to me so in my opinion it really works try it out for yourself use it to strengthen whatever intention that you set during the day so that you can also harness the power of the spiritual sun and I will put a link down here to the original exercise that, that my guru Sadhguru Nath Yogi Raj has shown so that you can also see it firsthand okay so this is not an exercise I created um, this is an exercise that was created by my guru Sadhguru Nath Yogi Raj and I will put a link down below so that's the technique to ward off evil, both physical and astral. So anytime before you do any astral work or anything physical that may bring us harm, this will help you. All right, this is Coach KP, peace.